This is Oddities. Mike and I are up at Brimfield, Massachusetts at a huge antiques fair. Despite getting drenched in this awful weather, we're looking for really cool stuff for the shop. We're also on a mission to find something abdominal for a burlesque customer of ours. Oh, hey, good to see you. Hey, hey how you doing? doing? We're looking for medical stuff, maybe something a little out of the ordinary. We're obnoxious antiques. I see Mike and Evan almost every week shopping at flea markets. They're a good customer of ours. I do have something over here. Oh, what the hell is this thing? I mean, this is, this is nuts. Well, that is a polygraph machine commonly referred to as a lie detector machine. And there's nothing really common about this machine. <laughs> it's crazy. Something from like NASA, you, you know, talk to astronauts, come in, get in space command. And what was the year on this? This was about 1969. Came from a hospital in New Jersey, and it was used in early childhood development. Well, like a behavioral laboratory exactly. or something? Exactly, exactly. Don't make me hit the button, kid. Yeah, that's yeah. right. That's right. Oh. Sit there, don't touch nothing. Shut Who the took button. the cookie all the way up to murder? <laughs> yeah, that's pretty yeah. much what this could do. <laughs> I mean, there's so many adjustments. I know normally a lot of detectors test your blood pressure, your heart rate, your sweating, sweating skin sensitivity. Although people do it all the time, lying is actually quite stressful to your body. The sympathetic nervous system, the uh, fight or flight system kicks in and these changes can be read by the polygraph. The problem with this is if a child was facing this, they'd probably get quite nervous. Their heart rate would- Start getting all sweaty. Yeah, sweaty. <laughs> so they might not read very accurately. Uh, probably not. What are you asking for this thing? What do we got into this? Uh, a modest $1,800. Does it still work? Well, unfortunately, some of the leads are missing, okay. and I don't think it would work right now. It's really tempting, but I don't know if we have the technological skills to fix this thing. I think it might be uh, beyond <laughs> us, beyond our capabilities here. I think we just want to pass on Yeah, it it's a big project. All right, well, thank well, you very thanks, much. Guys. Thanks, guys. Thanks a lot. Thank Great. you. Interesting, as always. Time, next Bye. time.